hi guys welcome back to our youtube channel coders lobby so in today's video we are going to see how we can get the system information so what do i mean uh, with the system information so suppose you have to get the ip configuration uh, ip address of that particular machine how you can get it if you want to get the machine name what is the machine name of that particular system or what is the current user which is logged in into the system um, or, or the current directory on which you are working so all the things we can get using the UI path so usually you have seen we uh, if we want the IP address we directly go to the CMD and there we have to search for IP config and then we can get the IP address so without going to the CMD command we can get all the things through UI path so uh, in today's video I'll first show you how we can get in the CMD then I will show you the demo in UI path as well how we can get all the things in UI path as well so let's get started without wasting any time so let me first open the CMD so I'll open the CMD and here I'll show you if you want to get the, uh, the IP, uh, IP address of this machine so how you can get it I will write IP config over here and I will hit enter. So here you can see IPv4. Uh, this is the IP address of my machine. So this is how we can get the IP address. And now I have to get the uh, the host name of this machine. Then how I can get it? I will write host name and hit enter. So you can see this is the host name of my machine. And uh, you want to get the machine the username of this machine so how you can get it with the domain so i'll write who am i so you can see this is giving me the uh, domain and this is the domain and after slash this is the user so this is how we can get all the things using cmd now i'll show you how we can get these things in ui path as well so for that what we have to do is uh, if we want to get the machine name what we can do we'll take one assign activity over here and we'll create a variable string type we'll write it as host name okay host name is nothing just a machine name so how i can get the machine name here i'll write environment dot machine name i'll hit enter and i'll take one message box activity let's take this and let's pass this my host name over here and i'll debug the code you will see it will uh, show the machine name of my machine so here you can see this is my machine name so how we can how we can get the machine uh, we can get it by environment dot machine name so this is about the machine name now let's suppose if we want to get the IP address of my machine. How I can get the IP address in UI path? Okay. So for now, let's comment it out. We'll take one more assign activity from here and create one more variable control K IP address. Okay, all right. And here we will write our command before writing the command what we have to do is we have to create a DNS type variable so what the DNS is DNS is nothing just the domain name system which convert the domain name of the system into the IP address form so it can be read by human so let's create first the DNS type variable I'll rewrite it as DNS all right it would be system.net.dns all right let's shoot dns dot get host by name all right on dns dot get host by name at the end dot address list of zero okay dot to string and done so it's showing something wrong what it is okay here we have to get it system name okay all right this is done now just pass the thing over here and let's debug the code you will see a pop-up will open that will show the ip address so you can see this is the ip address of my machine so this is how i can get the ip address so we have seen how we can get the host name how we can get the ip address and now i'll show you how we can get the current user of this 
particular machine so let me create one variable for the current user Let's create as current user all right so let's comment it out take one more assign activity over here assign equal to current user so there are multiple ways to get the current user of this machine so i'll uh, i'll show you the ways of how we can get it so there are one ways environment dot username so uh, what this will do it will only give you the uh, domain name of this machine sorry the domain name uh, like whatever you have seen in the cmd command uh, when i wrote uh, who am i there was two part of this one is the domain name second one after slash is the username so using the domain name we can get the uh, domain name but uh, and uh, what we can do we can do this thing and after that we will write environment dot username okay now we can uh, make the same like we have, we are getting into the cmd but i'll show you another way as well how we can get the username without using the environment so let's debug it first as you can see uh, first of first i'm getting the domain name second i'm getting the username so now let me show you how we can get it without making any custom things so for that we'll write system dot security dot principal dot window identity sorry dot window identity dot get current dot name dot to stream. now you, you can see it will show the username without any custom thing it will show first the domain name second it will show the username you can see we have uh, i haven't done any slash and all it it's showing me the domain name plus the username so this is how we can get the system information or uh, if you want to get the current directory then what you can do is you can write as environment dot current directory so this will show you the current directory on which i am current on which this ui path is currently open it will show the directory so you can see h project file this system info and system info ui path so this this is the current directory on which i am currently the ui path is open so i hope this this example are clear for you if this is the case please like the video and share it and subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any update whenever we post the new videos to our channel you will get the notification first we'll meet in our next video till the time bye bye